Hey guys, on today's video we're gonna go through top 10 trending games right now. So these are it. We're gonna go to the first one right now, which is like Candy Crush, which is Take the Cake. And um, once again, it's like Candy Crush. So if you play that, which most of you have, it's just like it. So it's kind of trending right now, just because people like that a lot. So I'm just gonna give you a quick preview of what the game's all about. And then we're going to go to the next one. So here we go. Um, so it's just like Candy Crush, like you can see right now. All you guys have to do is just move things around so you guys can match things up. You can see guys, it's just like Candy Crush. Uh, the next one I'm gonna go over is actually Candy Crush, which is really trending, has been trending for a long time. So again, most of you have played this, so I'm just gonna give you a quick preview for the ones that haven't seen it. So here's a quick preview of Candy Crush. Now Candy Crush can be a little bit easier than the other one. Anyways, that's it for Candy Crush. Just want to give you guys a quick preview of it. We're gonna go into our next one, which is Goat. That's actually one of my favorites and the top one that I consider just for me. Um, these are trending ones right now, and this one's actually trending, trending a little bit more, and uh, it is pretty fun and addicting. So this game is all about swiping, so you just have to swipe to make the goat move where you want it to go. Uh, sometimes you just have to make swipe faster than other times. If you fall, then you die. Obviously if you get hit one of those things, you also die. And uh, you do have to eat along the way or else you die as well. So, I'm just gonna go up. So once you're on the, those rocks, which is not green, so anything that's not green basically, um, except for the wood would actually be a bad thing so you have to move really fast throughout those parts so you guys don't fall or drown like right now anyways that's a quick preview of goat which is a great game then we're gonna go into sweet bakery sweet bakery is a game that you have to play pretty much horizontal on your screen so all these games are available for iphone ipad and ipod touch bakery bakery is about exactly how it sounds you have to prepare stuff so it's just a matter of swiping tapping um, you guys have to actually hold on to the milk to pour it in there once you're done that it'll take you to the next step so sometimes they have locks sometimes they don't sometimes you have to buy stuff um, however I wouldn't really spend actual real money on this so I'm just gonna close that up close that up I'm gonna go to my next one so if you guys want to bake some donuts for example you guys can just drag this over you guys have to actually turn this with your finger and then with your finger place it on the on there from there you just cook it and just swipe it out and then you guys can just swipe some glazing on it and we can serve it so that's the bakery type of deal that you guys want um, it's just a matter of just uh, swiping holding on to things and and doing things so you do feel a little bit more entertained with this just because that interactivity that it has with things that you can build and um, so of course you don't want to lose clients so you want to click on your client see what he wants and prepare that so I'm just gonna prepare this milkshake that he wants that's a quick preview of the game it's one of the top trending ones right now the next one over we're gonna be looking at roll the wall now this one is pretty difficult at times and um, you pretty much have to be paying attention the whole time or else you're gonna lose the game really fast. All these games are free and they're available, all of them are available for iPad, iPhone or iPod Touch. So this one's just about you not getting hit like that, okay? So you pretty much have to cover yourself just moving those circles around and for that you just have to with one finger just move them around. Um, there's a certain speed that this goes, it doesn't go too fast and uh, the thing is to keep those creeps away. So let's say if I move this really fast, there's only a certain speed. 
so that's why you have to pretty much time everything and what you guys want is to get really really good scores anyways that's about that game we're gonna go into our next one which is one of my personal favorites which is minion rush minion rush is actually my favorite not one of my favorites but my favorite one free one at the moment it's really well done and uh, let's just take a quick preview at it so we're gonna go right into the game um, the game doesn't lag at all, it's really well done, doesn't take out too much space either, and this one's just about swiping right and left, up and down, okay? So you want to swipe down once you get to these places, like right now, so you don't get shocked as I did at this moment. Uh, from there, you guys can revive your guy and just keep going, or you guys can just start all over. So once again, just swipe down, swipe up, side, down, and just keep going. The graphics from this game are really good, so that's why I like it, and uh, the game's pretty addicting as well. It's kind of like a race car, <laughs> kind of, you're kind of handling this guy like a race car. So the levels do become harder and harder, and what you guys want to do is just keep going and going and going and going. Anyways, that's a quick preview of that game. I highly suggest downloading this one, Minion and Goat. That's my personal favorites. And then we can go into Jenga. If you guys haven't played Jenga before, it's um, a pretty cool game that you can play online. Now, you don't have to play online. You can play the classic or arcade one. However, online is a little bit more fun because you get to play against real people online. So, you can play various games so you don't have to wait for one game because it you do have to take turns on it. So right now it's my turn to play against these guys. So I'm just going to click here. Now you can play as really a lot of games. So you can see what the person did right now. It's showing me a preview of what the person did in Jenga. And then it's my turn. So I'm just going to take out, for example, this one. So it does give you warnings. And I don't care in this case. I can just push it out. And then I can just kind of drag it out. And it starts moving, I can just go to the next one and turn another one over. Which is something that's also giving me a warning, so I'm just going to move this around. Sometimes it's good to move it around, just so that when the it's the next person's turn, it's harder for them to actually maintain this without falling. So the thing is to build this as high as you can without it making it fall. Okay. And uh, if it falls on you, then you lose, and so on. So you can see your history down here. And you can see whose turn it is. So right now it's their turn, all these guys that I'm playing against. And right now it's my turn for all these other guys. So again, it's online and you take turns. You can see a preview, again, of the person, what they did. And then you can do your thing. You can just take out something really fast. You can move it from the side. Uh, you can tap on it, you can do a lot of things, okay, so it's just like Jenga, so it's actually a pretty good game. Um, if you played Jenga before real life, this is just like it, so that's why I like it a lot. Um, so that's a quick preview of Jenga, also personal favorite. My top three from these trending games would be Mo Minion Rush, Goat, and Jenga. Then we're gonna go into Dumb Ways. This is a pretty funny game, so I'm gonna show you. And uh, the thing is not to die, okay, so we're gonna start this game let's just play game so you guys have to read what to do and um, just to be careful in not dying like this you have three lives okay so it's just about swiping sometimes tapping uh, it depends right now it's just tapping on the beast so they don't kill me by stinging me um, right now you guys have to kind of tilt your iPhone iPad towards that so once you, once you're in gravity, it's just tilting. Right now, you just do just tap on these guys, kind of flicker them off the piranha so they don't eat you alive. And there we go. So you keep getting more and more points. Right now, you just have to tap, and if you don't, you get killed like this. So next one over. Some are funny. Right now, it's just don't press the red button. It's really tempting to press that red button, but if you don't, you actually survive that thing. Again, that I just have to swipe up straight and then I wouldn't have died. Anyways, it's a fun game. I recommend it for sure. It's one of the trending ones right now. And then we're going to go into our last one, which is 1010. So let's just go right into it. So this game is trending. 
However, I don't find it that entertaining myself. It's just about placing blocks in the correct place in order to form a line. Kinda like Candy Crush, I could say. Kinda, but not really. So all you guys have to do this. Okay, you don't even have to get the correct colors in place. As long as you get a line going, you're good to go. So you can just place that here, and so on and so forth. So that's this game. Um, it's not my personal favorite at all. However, I know a lot of people like it, and it's kind of entertaining, kind of. Anyways, that's it for the top trending games right now. If you guys have any comments, questions, or how to download these, or if you guys can't get them to install on your iPad, you can write them down here below your comments or any questions. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.